everyone, this is Pravin Dore from Dice University. How are y'all doing? I hope y'all are doing great. In today's video, we are going to do a native advertising explained video. It's going to be an in-depth native advertising explanation video. So make sure you stay tuned till the end. But before that, let me just ask your help. Please, please support this channel by hitting the big red subscribe button for this channel as well as the like button for this video only if you like this video, guys. Only at the end of the video, not now. As well as the bell notification so that you don't miss any of upcoming videos and so that we can keep creating good content for you all the time so i'll be seeing you inside today's video guys let's go this video is brought to you by landerize.com create highly optimized landing pages in minutes get your 14-day free trial in the description below this video welcome to today's video everybody in today's video we are going to talk about native advertising i mean yesterday's video we literally told you on what is actually native advertising but in today's video uh, sorry native ads in today's video we are going to talk much more about what is native advertising how does it work how you already know what is actually a native ad and then now we want to know how you want to bring your native ads to the public what you should do and all this kind of stuff so if you if you if you're still in doubt right you can actually go ahead and watch my previous video i literally talked about what is actually native ads Ads, what type of native ads you got there what why you actually need to use a native ads uh, in the first place and what is the native advertising platform what's the use and all this kind of stuff so that was yesterday's video and today we are going to talk about basically native advertising explained okay so how you you already know now and how you want to bring the native ads to the public so basically there is three simple step which is involved step one step two step three so what is step one step one is that you need to go ahead and choose an offer because when you look at native ads right you talk about native advertising native advertising is simple like there's an ad there and somebody goes ahead to click on the ad they, they will be led to the landing page and then once you warm up yourself with the landing page then you go to the offer page and then you convert so that's the way the native advertising works so if you want to go ahead and do a native ad yourself this thing must be worth backwards you need to work the whole stuff backwards so the native ads actually work like, like you look at the offer and then you go to the landing page and then you go to the offer page right so we are going to do it upside down so step one is that you are going to go ahead and choose a particular offer so to choose a particular offer, you need to associate yourself with affiliate networks. So there's few affiliate networks out there, ClickBank, uh, Max Bounty, Gotcha, and all this kind of stuff. So totally depending on uh, how you want it to be. So each and every one of these affiliate networks has their own pros, has their own cons on how things work. Like for example, with ClickBank, it's very easy to actually get access to ClickBank. Uh, with Max Bounty, CPA offers works very well over here and all this kind of stuff so you need to go ahead and get your offer guys so there's few layers on how we actually penetrate the offer how we filter these offers and all this kind of stuff so totally depending on each each will actually depending on the affiliate networks guys so let's just go ahead and choose a particular offer uh, for example in Clickbank there's like a lot of niches here and then you can actually find the sub niches as well so once you have actually seen this we will always sort things by gravity with clickbank and once uh, we sort it by gravity we will take a look at the offer page and if the offer page is really really good then what we will actually do is we will start to promote the offer so it's very easy to promote the offer all you got to do is hit the promote button a pop-up will come and all you got to do is just hit generate hot links and your affiliate link would be there ready and the same thing with max bounty there will be a lot of offers you can actually see the top working offer the new offers max bounty offers trending offers or you can even search for the campaigns here so you can just go ahead and search for all the approved campaigns for example some campaign need to be approved so once you choose for all the approved offer uh, you click on the offer and this is how it will look like so all you got to do is just build the tracking link and then choose what type of offers you're going to do native raw they're going to select this one and this is going to be our affiliate link so this is what you need to do so 
uh, once you, this is step number one, no? So step number two is you're gonna build a landing page, guys. So we will be using Landrise to build a landing page. So if you wanna use Landrise, the link to Landrise is actually below. And that link actually offers you a free 14 days trial as well. So let me just tell you that step two is not a compulsory step with native advertising because in native advertising, you can still push that particular uh, from your ad straight away to your offer page but it's not highly recommended you're not warming up your audience not giving them space to breathe which is really really bad <laughs> which is something that we don't want to do and that's the reason why we want to create a landing page because we want to filter the audience we want to bring only quality audience to the offer page as well as we want to warm up the audience guys we want to engage with the audience so this kind of reason is why we actually need a landing page guys so once you have actually uh go to land it's very easy to do a landing page but before that make sure that you go to landrise and set everything up first so go to the getting started section and then make sure you do this like five tutorial videos make sure you concentrate on step two and step three where it will literally teach you on how to set up amazon s3 services and uh also how to connect your amazon s3 domain with your landrise guys it will take around 30 minutes to do this but make sure you do this first properly everything nicely and neatly because this is really really crucial and then you can actually go ahead and build a landing page you can just go to my landing page you can hit create landing pages and then you can choose a particular landing page there's like 58 templates right now and landrise is adding at least four brand new high converting templates every single week so you can just choose a particular uh a particular landing page for example this one just name it and then you can start editing it it's very easy to edit it i usually talk about this in the landerize channel itself how to edit each and every one of the landers so once you have actually added all these landers what will happen is you will go to the gear icon here you will rename the page title will rename the page title usually it's uh, relevant to your offer so once you rename your page title destination URL you're gonna put your destination URL you're gonna hit change links usually this destination URL is going to be your URL with volume which I'm gonna show you guys later uh, in a while it's gonna be a click URL from volume so you're gonna hit change links you're gonna make sure you save everything and then what's gonna happen is you're gonna hit publish when you hit publish they will literally ask you to choose a domain here so just choose whatever domain that you have already connected just now and make sure usually you only have one domain but if you have few just choose a domain hit publish and uh, this particular link will appear and this is the link that you're going to put in volume as well so what is actually volume volume is a tracker that we always use so you can actually see we have been using volume like for a few years this year alone we have actually made somewhere around three hundred fifty four thousand and five hundred eighty one dollars with volume guys so it's really really crazy guys so if you want to use volume i've actually attached the link to volume in the description below as well but why we need to use volume in the first place very simple guys this media buying business native advertising and everything it's all about data so the more data you have the more powerful you are what i mean by powerful is you can optimize your campaign much more easier you can scale your campaign much more easier you will know what to do you you even will know how to test a campaign and how to determine whether a campaign will be a winning campaign and all this stuff you know that's how powerful data can actually do so volume is the external place that we actually go ahead and collect all this data but with volume first thing is that you need to let volume know whatever affiliate network that you're using let it be a, a clickbank a max bounty or mobilia whatsoever guys make sure volume knows that and make sure volume knows what type of traffic source that you're using as well so the first thing that you need to do with volume is you need to go ahead and create an affiliate network and as well as you need to go ahead and create a traffic source as well so once you have done creating the affiliate network and the traffic source now you can actually go ahead and start creating the offer the lander and the campaign so you gotta let volume know what type of offers you're gonna run what type of lander you're using you're gonna put this link you know this thing i told you you're gonna put it in the lander your affiliate link that you got from your offer you're gonna put it in the offer so you're gonna link all of them and you're gonna do the same thing for campaign guys so 
uh, with campaign we do volume first then we actually go to the campaign section and I like like I told you this destination URL right you're gonna find this destination URL when you go to the gear icon in volume and then you're gonna go to the tracking URL section you're gonna see something called click URL this click URL that's what you're gonna paste it here so the final step once you have done all that is you need to go to a native advertising platform this is where you are literally going to go ahead and buy those native traffic okay so you're gonna go to this native advertising platform you there's a lot of famous ones outbrain mgid rave content is just to name few each of them will have their own pros and cons just like an affiliate network so make sure you go to this particular uh, uh particular native advertising platform choose a particular native advertising platform and run your ads there so basically that's how the whole flow of native advertising works guys and we do have another tools that we actually use called on tracks this tool is actually to help you with your native ads you will literally know what people are doing it's a spy tool guys and it's really really affordable sixty dollars per month if i'm not mistaken so this is why we actually changed it from adiplex city to anthrax so that uh, our users can actually afford it the link to anthrax is also in the description below guys so basically that's about it guys that's how i actually talk about native advertising and i think i've already explained native advertising very clearly so i really hope that you enjoyed today's video if you want to use any tools that we mentioned in today's video like for example volume on tracks the link is in the description below and if you want to use landerize as well the link is also in the description below with a 14 days free trial as well so you can use a uh, different type of uh whatever you want to use you can actually go ahead and use guys so uh, before i you before you go i just want to let you guys know please please support this channel by hitting the big red subscribe button the like button for this video only if you like this video as well as the bell notification so that you don't miss any of our upcoming videos and so that we can keep creating good content for you all the time i'll be seeing you in the next one guys till then tata bye bye